Hey guys, welcome back to another Spring Nights tutorial. As most of you know, these are this kind of colorful but still wearable, in my opinion, kind of tutorials. And today is this orange look that I think it looks so pretty in brown eyes, but I'm sure it will look amazing on any eye colors. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna try to mute all the darkness that I have on my lid, and for that, I'm gonna be using a concealer, a thin layer of concealer from Lash Line to Brow Bow. I guess that I forgot I had a choice. I let you push me past the breaking point. I stood for nothing, so I fell for everything. You held me down. For this look, I'm gonna be using the BH Cosmetics Galaxy Chick Palette, and I'm gonna take the color Mars, and I'm gonna apply it on top of my crease area. Get ready cause I've had enough I see it all, I see it now I got the eye of the tiger A fighter dancing through the fire. After I blended that color, I'm gonna go back to the palette and with a flat shader brush, I'm gonna take the color Venus and I'm gonna apply a few layers so I can build that color because it has a little bit of fallout. Then I'm going to take my favorite color from the palette, which is Aphrodite. I'm hoping I'm saying that right. And I'm going to apply it to my crease area. To create some balance in this look, I'm going to apply this matte color on my brow bone. Then with a flat foundation brush and the same concealer, I'm going to clean up the edges. Once again, since this was a very warm eye, I decided that I, need, I needed a little bit more balance. So I've applied gel eyeliner, which is going to define my top lash line and also wanted to do a cat eye to pull the look together. Since the lower part of my wing wasn't really perfect, I decided to go back to my concealer and with the same foundation brush, just clean up the edges. For even more definition and maybe a continuous line from my so dramatic wing eyeliner, I decided to line my waterline with this black eyeliner and also my tight line. Then I curl my lashes. I'm going to apply false eyelashes that are not very dramatic, but I still needed a coat of mascara in my top and bottom lashes. Going back to my multi-purpose concealer of today, I'm just gonna try to remove any fallout of the product and also cover my dark circles. Then going to the color sun, I'm just gonna apply it to my inner corner and now I'm gonna move on to my face. I decided to use this start foundation and really blended it in so I can have more of a full coverage effect but with a natural finish. I'm gonna contour my face with this pixie bronzer. You're gonna hear me and then I'm gonna blend with this e.l.f. powder brush just to make sure I don't have any harsh lines. You're gonna hear me. I decided to use more of a pinky kind of blush so I used pearlescent pink from Wet n Wild. For more of a glowy kind of look, I apply a little bit of highlighter. I 
also needed a little bit of a long lasting kind of lip product so I decided to line my lips and fill them in with this honey bun lip liner from Essence and then I've applied a little bit of a lipstick which is Make Me Pink from Maybelline and that way it's more of a neutral kind of color and at the same time very long lasting. And there you have it, that's the final look. I've been loving to do these eyes and I had a lot of compliments so I decided that this would be maybe worth sharing. So I hope you have a good day, thank you for watching and if you want more tutorials just check the info box for a lot more. I got the eye of the tiger, a 